Well, I'm joined by Irish and Liverpool legend John Aldridge. John, it was wet, it was windy. Did you enjoy it all the same? Yeah, yeah. We had, to be fair, we had the lads give us a run around. They had some some young legs out there for for the large parts of the game. You know, we were like we were average in age of about 45 ish, and uh, the, lads, the lads were pretty good. Some good players there. So we, we dug in, we dug deep, and uh, yeah, it was good. You know, I, I think a lot of pluses have got to go to the people who turn now because the weather's been pretty abysmal all day. You know, to get nearly 2,000 is uh, great credit to them. You, do you enjoy getting together with all your former pros and getting to have a kick about? We're very fortunate. We get asked to do a lot of these uh, these exhibition games, you know, especially in Ireland. And uh, we know uh, that the game the game's great, but uh, afterwards it's even better when we have the crack and a few got pints of Guinness. So that's the main part of the day, I think, you know. Are you going to be <laughs> Are you going to be singing? Oh, no, no, them days are well and truly behind me. <laughs> <laughs> Turning to more serious matters, Ireland have a massive couple of games coming up against France. How do you think Giovanni's, Trapattoni's men might get on? Um, well, it's, it goes without saying, it's going to be really tough. Um, we've just got to try and go to, to France unscathed, you know, get a clean sheet. And, uh, you know, they can get very touchy on their own ground, um, very nervy. And uh, it's going to be a nervous occasion, not just for us, but for them as well. Mm. Ribéry's out, which is a bonus. Hopefully Henri's out, that'll be another bonus and uh, give us a better chance. Are you happy with his squad selection that he announced the other day? Uh, I haven't seen it. Is Andy Reid in it? He's not, unfortunately. Well, or Stephen. Well, that's a pity. You know, them two lads, you know, I think uh, uh, are probably the future for us. We know he's playing ever so well, Andy Reid, at the moment. He's got great quality and uh, hopefully he can get, get in the squad sooner rather than later. And what about Liverpool? Uh, the do we have to talk about it? Just give that a miss, please, at the moment. I had to enjoy that game yesterday at Fulham, and uh, so I don't really want to talk about it at the moment. <laughs> Big game wins tonight, all the same. Yeah, do you massive, think they can do it? Game. Yeah, they can. You know, hopefully they'll get. They've had, they had 10 players injured, you know, against Fulham. They can't make no excuses, but, uh, you know, it's, it's a huge game, you know, financially down the road as well. The implications are massive. Um, but they've shown time and time again they can do it, but they're going to have to do it without Steven Gerrard, which is. Uh, you know, a big negative, but it's hard as it on the pitch, and you know we've got a stronger team out than, than we had against Fulham. Then it's possible. So we'll be bringing the European trophy back home again. It's a nice thought. You know, it was like times like this when we won it in Istanbul early on. We struggled in the league. You know, part of it. You know, but it's a long way away. <laughs> I held your I held your replica in your local bar in, in Liverpool, oh, yeah. your own bar in Liverpool. Yeah. That's, that's not a replica. That's the real one. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you're promoting it like it is. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, no, it's John. good, though. All the best. Cheers. Thanks very much. Thank you.